and you are watching Peach Perfect. Thanks so much for tuning in. So today I have got a beauty product review, no clothing today, um, and I am super excited. I've just gotten it in and I'm having good luck so far and I'll tell you what I mean by that in just a second. Before I jump into the details on this, a couple of reminders. One, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so happy to have you here. Please subscribe. You don't want to miss out on all the awesome videos I've got coming up soon. Two, I do have an Amazon wish list. So if there's something in particular that you want to see me review or be a guinea pig for, definitely check out my Amazon wish list. And three, I do have a Patreon account. So if there's more of an exclusive side to me that you want to see, definitely check out my Patreon. I post weekly exclusive um, selfies and videos, actually. So um, lots of good content on there that only my patrons see. So on to the good stuff. So today I am going to be talking about a company and product called Myro. And what it is, is it's a little deodorant. And a couple things that I love about this whole idea, and again, let me just give you kind of a, a little recap of my, my deodorant experience. So probably about six, eight years ago, um, I don't know if y'all are aware of this, but typically in antiperspirants, the main ingredient, the aluminum, aluminum something, um, is being linked to Alzheimer's, dementia, um, they're linking it to all sorts of horrible things. And at that point when I read this article and there's a ton of, ton of research, a ton of articles about it, I'm not a doctor, but anything, there's nothing in this world that scares me more than either of those things. Having, um, taking care of family members that have passed from that. It's very personal and it's very scary to watch and nothing in this world scares me more than that. And so when I found out the correlation between the two, I vowed to myself that I would never use another deodorant with this, with this aluminum product in it. And I haven't. Um, but <laughs> that's the tricky part is that these all natural deodorants that don't have the antiperspirant and only have the anti deodorant, so they just take care of the odor and not the perspiration. Um, it makes it kind of tricky because I'm a sweater. Um, I I sweat, and I'm also extremely, extremely, extremely sensitive to like fragrances and everything. I'm I'm I break out in a rash from like anything. I have to be super careful about what lotion I use and what what chapstick I use and I'm, I'm very, 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 very sensitive to products. So it's very hard for me to find things that work and I have tried them all. I've tried Native. Native gave me horrible, horrible, horrible rash all around my armpit with like cyst bumps in there that like were there for like a month at a time and they were so big and so painful. They were like the size of a lima bean. Nothing against Native, nothing against most of these products. Everything works differently for different people. Um, but I tried Schmidt, and I tried Jason, and I tried, um, I mean, any anything that you can think of that's all natural, organic, aluminum free, I tried. Um, and none of them have worked. They've either, I've either swept through them in like five minutes and reeked after, and being a dental hygienist, I can't really have stinky armpits because the last thing you want to do is go get your teeth cleaned and be smelling BO the whole time. So, um, some of them worked and didn't like break me out, but I sweat through them in five minutes and I stank. And then the other ones that worked with odor, I was allergic to or had a reaction to of some sort. Now they typically say, any of the companies that, that have these, these um, new, like more organic deodorants, they typically say that you wanna give it like at least three to four weeks for your body to kind of adjust to it. So I'm in my, I just basically finished my first week using this and I know usually within a week or two if I'm gonna be allergic to them. Um, I just tried another, oh my God, a super expensive one that was like $11 at Target. 
and um, and it was very, 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 very perfumey. It was like a rose scent, and it actually smelled really good, but it was like overwhelming um, perfume smell. And I was, as soon as I opened it, because it was, it was closed, so you couldn't like smell it at the store, so I had to get it. And as soon as I smelled it, I looked at my husband and I was like, I'm gonna break out from this because it's too perfumey. Um, and within, I think, five days of using it, it actually worked scent-wise, but literally my armpits had huge red rings around it. They were so tender. I could barely shave for a couple days my armpits just because they were so like raw. Um, so I couldn't use it and that's basically what happens to me like every month I try a new one and it doesn't work So I haven't given it a full month, but so far so good But even if it doesn't work for me I'm really excited about this company because they stand for a lot of the things that I really love and care about so one of which there's super, um, let me just, I'm, 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 I want to show you all some of the things. So, um, basically all of their scents are pant, pant, plant powered and mood boosting for everybody. Um, they're hardworking, long lasting formula with no toxic anything, which is super important to me. Our biggest organ in our body is our skin and what you put on your skin affects us big time. So I am a big believer in putting as much natural stuff on and in my body as possible. Um, the main thing that I love about this is that they've got refillable cases and recyclable deodorant pods. So what happens is, is when you get, when you order one, basically the way that this works is you order the color pod, the case that you want, not pod, the case that you want. And I think they've got like, um, they've kind of got like a, a, like a rust color, a mint, um, kind of like a purple, the rose, like the magenta color, a gray and a, a light gray, uh, kind of like a, a blue, and then like a real dark slate black gray. So then what you do is you get these little pods and you just pop the pod in, screw it down. And so you keep this little case and it is good for the environment because we're, they're using a ton less plastic to wrap the pods in. The, the plastic around the little pod that goes into the case is super thin. Um, so then they've got a bunch of different scents to choose from as well. And the cool thing is, is it's one of these like where you can order, like it's, it's, it's like a big shipment, like every three, four, six months. So you typically get three pods each time you order, which is awesome because then you're also cutting back on like shipping if you were just to get one at a time, um, which again is good for the environment. So I just love what this company stands for. I love what they're trying to do. And it's really relatively cheap compared to some of the other ones. And you know, they're, they're basically about $10. But the cool thing is, is that when you try it out for the first time, you get the case for free and then you're only paying $10 for the actual pod. Then typically you get three, like I said, three each time you get a shipment and they're $30, so $10 a piece. So yes, it's definitely more on the pricey side, but it's not it's not as bad as some of the ones that I've tried that are like, you know, $20 a piece, and they're bad for the environment because you're using a bunch of plastic that you can't recycle. So um, the one that I tried, the scent is, so they've got, it's called, or, well, it's not called, it's called Solar Flare, and it's orange, juniper, and sunflower. Then there's another one called the Big Dipper. Um, it's got bergamot and lavender and another word that I have no idea how to pronounce, so I'm sorry. Um, then the one that I got, and I like, it's kind of strange, um, but I like. It's just, it's not something that I would have expected for a deodorant, but I thought that it sounded like it would be a good scent for like the way I smell, um, and it's cucumber, jasmine, and spearmint, and it's called the Chill Wave. Pillow Talk is apparently one of their big ones, and it's violet leaf, 
wild something and another word that I have no idea how to pronounce. Sorry, y'all. Um, then cabin number five is a word that I can't pronounce, patchouli and geranium. And then open air is just unscented. So they do have just a scent free, which is awesome as well. Um, but I just, I like what they stand for. So even if they don't work for me, um, because I'm just super sensitive to everything, um, I like what they stand for. I like that they're trying to be very proactive and helping the environment, which is super important. Um, so give them a try. I'm going to reach out to them since I like it so far and see if they will give me a code for all of y'all if you want to try it. Um, cause I've seen a couple of bloggers that have done, you know, like a code that you can get it for $5 instead of $10. So let me reach out to them. I'll keep y'all posted. And if I do get a coupon code, I'll post it to the bio of this video. I just need to reach out to them cause I wanted to see if I liked it first, um, before I was, you know, giving y'all a product, you know, a bunch of, bunch of coupons for a product that I didn't like. So I definitely want to reach out to them and see if they will do that, which I'm sure they will. So hopefully they will. So keep, keep, you know, stay tuned on that. I'm a little frazzled as you can see, and I don't know why. I think it's just, I've got a lot of stuff to do today. So bear with me because I know that this video has kind of been painful with my like stuttering and stammering. Um, but I hope that that was helpful. I will keep y'all posted on how this is working for me. So far, so good. I'm not smelling like terrible. I definitely, with this, you definitely have to reapply more than you would an antiperspirant. And that's with any of the just anti-deodorants that you're, you're gonna use because you are sweating through it a little bit more. So you definitely have to use, you know, to, I, I usually keep this in my makeup bag. Um, so I just can kind of reapply a couple times throughout the day. But I'd much rather have that than, than you know, make it easier for me to get dementia and Alzheimer's and all that crazy stuff. So definitely check them out. And like I said, I'll, I'll keep y'all up to date on if we get a coupon code or not. But I hope that that was helpful and I hope that y'all are having a great weekend. If you want to find me on Instagram, you can do so at MyPeachPerfect and my personal account is Badass Glass. And I hope y'all have a great weekend. Mwah.